What's up, y'all? Today we're doing something a little bit different. Um, so if you guys, you know, you guys know my Firebird, right? You know, it's got some mismatched doors and whatnot. And um, we're gonna be washing it. But then for kicks and giggles, we're also gonna be doing one of those uh, cheap paint jobs. And I know, uh, cheap, not gonna look great. But, you know, um, my plan in the future, eventually, so I completely redo the body and stuff. And after that, I'll get a professional paint job done. But I don't like the mismatched body panels and whatnot. So I figured, you know what? It's already missing paint and it clear coats faded and whatnot. It's got mismatched body panels. Let's just do a cheap, fun paint job because it'll be fun and it'll make the car look more uniform, which I certainly would enjoy having a uniform looking car. Pop uh, the heck, is that on? No, it's not, it's just on. Anyway, sorry. So we're going to be washing it first and then prepping it. And then we will be painting it and maybe doing some other stuff. Not really sure yet. We're going to see how long it takes to do this. And uh, let's get started. We're just going to start by we're just hand washing it because I don't want to get the pressure washer out here. And uh, we're going to do that real quick just to kind of get all the dirt that's been on it off. And then we'll start covering up and getting it prepped for actual painting. So that's what we're doing today. Um, there might be a few areas I need to... Like, I might need to peel some clear coat off and do a... I'm going to do a rough sand on it, obviously, but I'm kind of debating finding something to cover this vent hole up, just so it's not bare right there. But I don't really know yet, and then we're, we'll clean up the wheels as well. But I'm not going to show you guys the color yet, because it's kind of a bit of a surprise. But, uh, yeah, we're, let's, uh, let's get into this. How about... Okay, so we got a rough wash done on it. Next up is I'm going to sand it down, so that way the paint will actually stick. And we might rust, we might, we're probably going to wet sand the paint after, not entirely sure. But the first step is just to uh, get all the sand down so that way the paint can actually stick to something. And then we'll start taping off. So, got this out. Ready to do this? Okay, so we went over it with some sandpaper. Uh, now we just got to wash all the dust off. Then we're going to start taping areas off. Again, it's not going to be the best paint job ever, but it's going to be fun, right? All right, so right now we've got Amanda doing some taping off on the uh, reflectors and the door handles. I'm putting trash bags over the wheels to cover it up and uh, going along nice and smoothly. Um, as far as the windows goes, I think we might do a little bit of like paper around them. And then if any overspray gets on them, we can just scrape it off with a knife, you know, that's because knives don't scrape windows. So I'm not too worried about that. Same with the T-tops and whatnot. But uh, anyway, yeah, it's going pretty well right all right we're just masking off the taillights right now we've also we might do some on the um the windows but we also can just scrape any excess paint off so i'm not too worried about that that's actually a pretty common trick i've seen people just scrape off the overspray but uh taillights are taped off and uh yeah we're getting about ready so i don't know if we're gonna film the painting or not i don't really know how we're gonna do that yet so i guess we're just gonna find out how it goes right Well, we've gotten one coat of paint on. This is the day after. As you can see, it is uneven and I haven't finished taking stuff off yet. But like, not half bad given how bad it was before with the mismatchingness. I am going to be doing more layers and then doing a wet sand and clear coat, don't get me wrong. But I've got something going on later this afternoon that I need to take the fiber to. And I still think this looks better than before. Again, I mean, obviously it was never gonna mean with the messed up front bumper and stuff, I wouldn't expect anything to be perfect. But, you know, it's at least better than before because now at least the whole car is one color compared to being like five. <laughs> so we still got to do all the unmasking and get some stuff kind of cleaned up a little bit. But overall, actually surprisingly better than I thought. Even though, again, there is definitely some unevenness. Some of that is also just caused by the water that's on the car right now because it rained last night. Okay, so I already showed you guys the car, blah, blah, blah. Still need to do more coats, but that's whatever it is. We're doing something different, though. We're doing... 
No, it's called a catalytic converter delete, Zach. So if we just run around over here, it already doesn't have a muffler, but it's still really quiet. And also the current cow in it, I think is a bit plugged up anyway, but just literally right there. So it should be pretty easy to get to. We're just gonna snip, snip, pipe, put a pipe through and call it good at that. Should take more than like a half hour knowing us because we've done this so many times at this point. But uh, yeah, let's get cracking. Start the day. You start the day by cutting off your mufflers. <laughs> Every day, cut a new muffler off. I just go to the junkyard to do it now. Yeah, right? Okay. Okay, Mr. Mans with the saws. Oh, wait, 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 hold on. We're missing a very important thing. We need to do the before. Oh, I thought you were gonna do safety glasses. I mean, you're right. Yeah. Who needs safety glasses? I believe in you. Kick Listen. it. Ow, my foot. Okay, I, I put my faith in the wrong person. Apparently, hold on. No one needs you. Okay, now start that. Start it up. She better be loud. Better not disappoint. Oh, no, so. Exactly, so she better be loud. Like it. Okay, so cat's out. We got some pipe laid down here. We're gonna have to take this clamp off to get this stuff off so we can get the pipe to slip over it. Do other stuff to it. Yada yada yada. <laughs> I'm gonna get this cut off so we can get the pipe to slip over and whatnot. So I'm just gonna snip, snip, snip and get it off. Nice and easy, like. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I've taken a grinder to this and I'm peeling it back so I can get this little what you see part of the cat off so this will slip onto it it makes sense right no nope. it doesn't make sense uh -uh. oh well that's a that's a shame <gasps> no nope. i feel like we slowly get faster and faster we times. do so we got uh where'd it go jack threw it away but we got the thing off we need to get off now we got to cut this down so it all fits nice and perfectly together and we'll get it all bolted up this is our fifth car doing this too Technically, this is a cat, but like okay, the process of deleting something. Of deleting something in the middle of the car. Yep. This doesn't have a resonator, so it's basically the same as a resonator delete. Yeah, because we've done the Pontiac, we've done this Pontiac, we've done the Subaru, Subaru we've done the Corolla. Corolla. And you've done your Honda. Yep. Okay, well, let's get to this. Well, boys, we got a full pipe going through there, the AutoZone Special. Let's, uh, here, Zach. You hold the camera. I'm gonna fire her up. Zach's doing all the good boy work. He's doing good boy points. Sorry, my hands in the way there. Stay with though. I used to these afternoon knimmerness. That's a proper muscle car. Okay. Well, this car doesn't like you to be safe. Yeah, it doesn't. It's time for the first test drive. Um, let's hope that the camera doesn't start to decide to start freaking out on Zach. It's gonna just, freak out on me. I just hold that thing incredibly carefully. That's all you gotta do. I feel like this is a lie. I feel like it's a setup. Probably. Just that, just that idle. Yeah, still record right now. I think you freed up some horse purrs, bro. Probably. I still gotta take the um the belt off. Honestly, she feels a little more like you know.
gonna do it for today's video. We just only had time for the delete and of course the paint job, but stay tuned for more. We're, we've got more serious stuff coming along in the next once we have more money, but uh, you know, it's always fun to do this kind of dumb stuff. So stay tuned and see you guys next time.